who are close to me would know that I was going through a very difficult period in October of 2010. And it was also around that same time that I started to pray very intently to God and ask Him to send me someone who shares the same family values as I do and more importantly, the love of God. It wasn't too long thereafter that I got to know Jackie. And what amazed me even more was how comfortable I felt whenever I was with him and how easy things transitioned for both of us. We never planned to have our first date in the church, but we did. We never thought it would be engaged six months later, but we did. We never thought that we would get married a year later, but we did. And another six months later, here we are today, celebrating this joyous occasion with all of you. I guess we just have to pray and ask for it and be open to whatever God has planned for us. Just open our arms and receive it. Just like the pieces of a puzzle are coming together I like the way you look in this weather Whether or not you could love me Well, it's just too soon to tell I want to lie on our backs Make a plan for escape And I want you to want to hold my hand on It began when we found each other On a site on the internet We started exchanging some emails And soon after, long distance phone calls But quickly, we got very frustrated by that So I decided to jump in a blue band and flew back for some lunches and a chat. Next to you, with death and sin, love in this thing together, love for worse and better. I'll take you now, say you say I do. I picked her up from her house on Christmas Eve 2010. We got on so well, and it was so clear to me that this woman by my side could seal my fate. But I honestly never expected such a major change in my life that a year to the very day later that this woman would be my wife. One, two, three, four. I need you. Won't you say you need me to? Honey, I'm a mess, but I'm my best, and I'm right next to you. With death and sin, love in this thing together, love the worse and better. To me, Judy is beautiful, she's understanding, gentle, and smart. With her lovely, sweet, caring nature, it truly touches my heart. I believe you have heard the phrase in that video. I know our most thrilling and exciting adventures have yet to come, and I can't wait to share all of them with you. I love you too. for all he has done for me. Throughout my life, he's always been the first person I turn to for help, and not to mention money. As the youngest in the family, I often take things for granted when I was a kid. Need a lift to school? Call our ba. Forgot my wallet or keys when I'm at school? Call our ba. Start in school due to the rain? Call our ba. Need more pocket money? Hmm. But I'm going out, I just took X dollars from your wallet. I would like to also thank my mom for, love, for her love, support and guidance throughout my life. You are the best mommy ever, and I would never be where I am today if it wasn't for your encouragement. there, Mr. Chan, Mr. Charlie Chan, and the queen of the Chan family, Madam Choi Simoy. To just say thank you doesn't nearly seem enough. 
I can never repay the debt that I owe you for all that you have done for me all these years. You have both taught me to explore patiently, always seek adventure safely, and to always have fun, go out and see this magnificent world. Thank you, Mom and Dad. I love you. I love you. I'm so thankful that God has sent me to you. And vice versa, Scott. Yeah, should be. <laughs> It is lovely to see so many of our family and friends here today to help us celebrate the happiest days of our lives. It would have never been the same without all of you. Unfortunately, it's not always possible to have everybody here we love, but we know they are here with us in our spirit and not only in our thoughts today, but most important, they are here with us in our hearts. I'd like to thank everybody for coming today especially you, Julie.